Hello, everyone. I'm Karen Berman, and I'm the immediate past president of the Society of Biological Psychiatry. I miss being able to, to see you all at our 2020 meeting in New York City, but I very much look forward to our next in-person meeting. In the meantime, today I have the privilege of introducing to you the winners of the 2020 SOBP Awards. These awards will be conveyed in person at our 2021 meeting in San Diego. For now, please join me in virtually congratulating each of these wonderful colleagues. The SOBP Educator Award is to recognize the need for educational excellence, innovation, scholarship, and engagement in teaching biological psychiatry. This year's awardee is Dr. Sophia Vrangu at the ICANN School of Medicine at Mount Sinai. So I am delighted to have the opportunity to present the Society of Biological Psychiatry Teaching Award uh, to my colleague, Dr. Sophia Frangu. I'll give you a little bit of background on uh, Dr. Frangu. She uh, received her medical degree from the University of Athens in Greece, um, and then she went on to receive a master's degree in neuroscience and a PhD in psychiatry from the University of London in the UK. She then continued to rise through the ranks on the faculty at the Institute of Psychiatry at King's College London. And in 2013, she went across the pond to join the faculty at the Icon uh, School of Medicine at Mount Sinai, where she's now a professor of psychiatry. And Dr. Frangu's work aims to delineate the neural basis of psychotic disorders and particularly taking a lifespan approach to understanding um, genetic, systemic, and environmental influences on brain structure and function and uh, using this knowledge to develop novel interventions for severe mental illness. So her work has had a really major impact on the field. Um, she's won several awards, and I'll just mention a few here. Uh, uh, the Psychopharmacology Prize from the Royal College of Psychiatrists and um, the Colvin Prize for Outstanding Achievement in Bipolar uh, Mood Disorders Research from the Brain and Behavior Research Foundation. She's published um, more than 200 uh, peer-reviewed papers in her career. And uh, one of the reasons that I thought Dr. Frangu was particularly deserving of this teaching award was really because of the strong focus throughout her career on promoting diversity, uh, with this really special focus on the role of women in academic psychiatry. She has authored and edited a book entitled Women in Academic Psych Psychiatry, A Mind to Succeed, uh, which I highly recommend. And I have had the great pleasure of working with Dr. Frangu as uh, she co-chairs with me the Women's Leadership Group of the uh, Society of Biological Psychiatry. Um, she's also involved in women's leadership initiatives in uh, the International Society of Bipolar Disorders. And in her role as co-chair, um, Dr. Frangu has really made a number of major contributions. And in particular, she advocated for a series of short videos um, that highlight the role of women scientists in uh, the SOBP. And I think these videos have been really uh, successful in highlighting women as role models in science and academia. And uh, Dr. Frangu has a long history of mentorship of research track residents um, at King's College London, uh, which really helped to establish um, the Maudsley Hospital and KCL as leading international centers for fostering uh, clinical academic careers. And many of her trainees uh, who really benefited from her mentorship now have leadership roles in the field. Um, and she's continued to play a leadership role in mentoring junior faculty and trainees in her position at Mount Sinai. And um, I should mention that her research has been really influential in uh, my own work. Um, she pioneered some of the first studies to investigate neural correlates of resilience to neuropsychiatric disease, which I think is an incredibly important construct. And uh, so I encourage you all to read her work and uh, get to know Dr. Frangu at our next in-person meeting. Um, and so I'm just so pleased to honor you, Sophia, uh, with this award. Congratulations. <laughs>